Have a go walk in your fields. Then watch this video. Hello, I'm Griff Reese. Welcome to Winning Griffith. Here we talk everything beekeeping, farming, countryside living, and we do reviews as well. Now today, I'm down on one of these fields where there's no mains water. There's a big thousand litre concrete drinker here, and there's no water. So I'm just going to show you the system that we're using here to carry water here for the cattle. It's quite simple. I've got a bowels out there behind the pickup. Just drive the pickup onto site where you need it. And the thing with these type of bowls is, is it's only got a small tap in on the back there. And that's actually much lower than the level here. And if I were to turn that tap on, that might look like a lot of pressure, but it actually, it'll take hours to fill that tank up so i've got a little system that i use do this job really really quick i've got a, a small petrol journey in the back and as these journeys they come with a 16 amp plug you've got to have an adapter so something like that where that plugs in there. You've got an ordinary 40 socket. And I've got a little water pump to put on the back. And I'll show you how I do this and how easy it is. And if you've got fields, maybe silage fields, but you'd like to graze them, then maybe you can adapt something like this, quite low cost. And really, you know, we've got a proper water bowser there. Just be a trailer with a couple IBC tanks and you can just go around all the drinkers, pump the water out. So nothing left to it. Get the journey started, start pumping the water for you to see what kind of flow this has got and you know the whole system hasn't cost much. This gen litter was 50 pounds second hand. I think this water pump is probably the same kind of money new second hand, you're probably talking 20 quid. Obviously the bowser, if you were to buy bows like this second hand, I'll probably be off 500 quid. For a couple of IBC tanks on a trailer, that's pretty much going to be under 100 quid as long as you've got a, got a trailer. I think IBC tanks, they sell for about 50 quid these days, clean ones. But yeah, that's how uh, I cast the water on these fields where there's no water. Let's fire it up for me to show you how it works. All I'm doing here with a rope, I'm tying this switch up because if as I'm pumping this tank it goes low, once that falls flat the pump switches off. So I tie that up so that I can pump right down to the bottom of the tank and she's not gonna cut off. That's it, that's how easy it is to fill a drinker up with Bowser and a water pump with a generator. And with this type of system, you've got the electric with a generator, you can go absolutely anywhere. It could be a top of a mountain, bottom of a hill, 
10 fields away, doesn't matter, you can cut the water and take it easy. And this suits a small holding type situation where you just fill it one drink at a time, em empty this completely into that drinker now, and the job is done. Obviously, if you've got a much bigger unit, you could put a big tank behind a tractor, get a bigger water pump, and do it like that. The system remains the same. It's just when you rely on gravity when you're so low, it doesn't really work very well. If the IBC tank was on a big trailer, quite a high trailer, you could open the tank and fly the water directly. That'll probably work quite well. But with the bows like this, you got to pump it out. Well, if you like this video and you want to watch more of the same kind of content, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I try my best to put new videos every week. Thanks for watching.